Can I be perfectly honest with you, everybody? <laughs> I am confused and disappointed on two fronts right now. Number one, it took me a solid three minutes to understand why I was on the water at all. I was also very confused why any larvae were able to follow me. And two, I thought I was returning to autumn. But no, it's the beginning of summer still. But why is that disappointing, you ask? Well, because I wanted to do a really, really cool suggestion by one of you in the very comments with a moose goose. But no, it's not moose goose's time right now. It's deer clopses. Oh, but here's a question. Okay, <laughs> I was gonna wonder, whoops. I was gonna wonder who I was uh, gonna turn into. Oh my goodness. Well, it is summertime. <laughs> this seems quite appropriate. Oh, but don't you worry, everybody. Even though my plans were slightly foiled, we still have plenty of plans here today. We are going to the ruins with Deerclops, folks. The guy that can literally destroy structures with his hand, I might remind you. And why is that in any way of note, you ask? Well, because when you do destroy said structures with your hands, you gain sanity. So, all I need for this trip is healing, folks. And would you believe it, everybody? Dear Klops's base just so happens to be right in the blue mush tree forest. Beautiful. All right, one of these days, I'm definitely gonna have to touch up on all these bosses' bases, you know what I mean? I have a lot to put on this tree, for example. Thing is though, everybody, I'm thinking I might not actually need that many blue mushrooms because it just came to my attention that we already been to the ruins. I mean, it was a quick trip and we barely did anything, but I mean, we mapped it out. We know what we're walking into. We killed some clockworks already. So uh, I'm probably good with what I already have. Except I also just realized I didn't bring down any nightmare fuel. Right. So right then, this is one of those very rare moments where I'm actually excited and welcoming a nightmare cycle that is blocking my entrance to the ruins. Perfect timing game. Oh, and let's not forget Splue Monkeys, everybody. Ouchie, 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 ouchie. Splue Monkeys, also easy nightmare fuel. Good stuff. Oh, except when there's 18 million of them. It's fine, though. It's fine, it's fine. I got ice attack. I got ice. Oh, it's not winter, though. Right. That attack is only AOE in winter. Okay, maybe I should pick my battles a little wiser, actually. All right, so the mass murder begins early, I guess, everybody. <laughs> I'd have it no other way. Oh, depth worms, everybody. My gosh, it's been a while. I was so confused. I was hearing things in my ear. I'm like, what is that noise? It's the uh, depth worm warning noise. Right. Triple depth worm, everybody. And on top of that, toss in a freaking nightmare. And there he's, the nightmare's getting pushed by, oh my gosh. Okay, nightmare first, then get these guys on the same attack cycle, then we'll be in business. Here we go, folks. Okay, get them on the same attack cycle, and honestly, you'd be surprised how little horde mobs actually matter. All right, three attack cycles, going for hits, absolutely beautiful. Man, I really wish I had my AoE ice attack right now, though. Beautiful, everybody. Yeah, yeah, took a knack or two, but it's fine. All right, let's, uh, let's see what we're dealing with here. Hello, Rook. Hello, Bishop. Rook, might I interest you in, uh, you know, running over your friends? That'd be great. Unfortunately, you completely missed your friend. <laughs> Come on, dude. Are you seriously gonna do that to me? Okay, there is now a, uh, Bishop fighting a second Rook because they might have pissed each other off. This is working out tremendously, I might add. Slight problem, everybody. Um... I think Deer Clops might be broken. He can't. Oh, nope, never mind. <laughs> I had something in my hands. Good. Okay, now it's time to talk about why I don't have to care about sanity whatsoever. Watch this. I'm going to go ahead and destroy this thing. This watch. Oh, my God. It had to be. It had to be an occupied one. It just had to be an occupied one. Let's try that again, shall we? Okay, let's take this out of my hand. Let's destroy this. Boom, boom, boom. And that is, oh, game, 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 
Gang, please, for the love of everything, just freaking stop. Third time's the charm? Let's find out. But, I'm gonna go ahead and destroy this. Boom, there we go. 20 sanity, a destroyed structure. Oh, yes. Now I can chew on these and feel totally fine about it. Well, I had one strategically help me. Now I've had one strategically block me. Everything's even. But here she is, everyone. The deconstruction staff. Absolutely beautiful. All right, let's make a couple of these suckers too. But I ain't deconstructing it quite yet, folks. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm probably gonna need these tiny little bowler lights moving forward. As next on the- oh my- Okay, all right, I, I get it, game. I get it, I get it, I get it. This is, this is just frivolous. I really don't need to clear the ruins. I totally get it. Oh my gosh, now this guy's over here. I don't need to clear the ruins at this point, so this is all just extra, and you're punishing me for that. But can you please not do that? And my goodness gracious, look who's calling everybody. <laughs> At Lion must be angry that she's not included in this mod. But joke's on you, you're not an OG Reign of Giants boss, Ant Lion. But seriously, Mini Clops here might be the best run to clear the ruins. It's insane, it's insane. I can go insane, destroy a couple structures, boom, good. It's amazing. It's absolutely fantastic. And you know, I don't often do it because it's usually a terrible idea, but I'm kind of just down here to destroy stuff. <laughs> That's really all my plan is today. Yeah, we're gonna take down uh, the Ancient Guardian. That's the big picture today. But for now, I'm just having fun destroying stuff and I'm gonna keep destroying stuff. Oh, and I bloody found it, folks. The actual Ancient Pseudoscience Station. It was right around the corner that whole time. <laughs> But man, that one little ruin strip that we did the other day, whoo, that was a little ill-advised, was it not? I love how almost self-sustaining Deer Clops feels in the caves. And especially the ruins, let me tell you. I can just go into all these clockwork fights, get my absolute crap pushed in, and I'm totally fine afterwards just by, you know, destroying some of these structures that you're going to destroy otherwise. It's a really, really neat feeling. And with that comes a plan I honestly wasn't expecting to do. I was going to go back up and probably get some marble for the Ancient Guardian fights. But now, since I can literally do what I just said, get all the full sight in the world without having to worry about going back and forth this whole bloody dang time, I bet you I can just farm enough to get all the crowns in the world. I have a Magaluminescence. I have my freezing ability. Oh yes, I betcha we can really do a number on this guy in a minute. Then again, I'll need more healing as these things are getting bad on us. But once again, I'm literally basing in like the healing factory of the underground. <laughs> once again, man, didn't plan this. You guys are the ones that said that Klopp should base in the caves and bloody heck. I'm sorry I ever thought otherwise. I never want to clear the ruins with anybody else ever again. <laughs> this is just, this, this just feels wrong. Oh, you lost your tool? No problem. <laughs> Literally just happened right now. I'm out of tools. I was like, oh crap, that's bad. I didn't bring down anything to make more. Then I remembered. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Man, I'm having, I'm having way too much fun with this. Oh, but ruins are still dangerous, everybody. <laughs> Might have went and destroyed a uh, second broken ancient pseudoscience station to be greeted by bats. And of course, a uh, nightmare. Again, I'm just having so much fun, though. I don't even freaking care at this point. And can I just say, holy moly, the ruins look really cool when there's a full-blown nightmare cycle on and polar lights everywhere. Ooh, I love it. I also love how we started this journey with a crap ton of football helmets, and now we're ending it with a crap ton of full side crowns. Only seems appropriate. And by crap ton, I do mean crap ton. Like, almost a full inventory's bar worth. Oh yes, we're ready to go. Apart from one slight issue. No more food, no more healing. So yes, before we end the day with rumbling, bumbling, stumbling against the Ancient Guardian, yeah, need to fix that. Oh, but not before I find my bestest friend in the world, folks. Hutch indeed. Come on, hoppin', my dude. Oh, I love you, Hutch. 
I absolutely adore ya. Oh, but he brought some friends of his own, everybody. <laughs> Hello. What the heck? This guy came out of freaking nowhere. You know, I think I'm pulling another last week, everybody. I'm adding something extra at the end of the original plan. Don't you worry. I'm knocking on the door of the Ancient Guardian as we speak. But I'm already down here. I have the deconstruction staff. I have the Mooncaller staff in base. Why not just deconstruct the dang thing, activate the archive, and be good to go? Yeah, that's how we're gonna end the video, I think. But hello, Ancient Guardian. Well, of course, hello the Labyrinth, but eventually we'll find the guy. And by eventually, I mean right flipping out. <laughs> okay, hello, my dude. Let's place one of these. Now, I'll be honest, it's been a while since I've kited this dude, so, um, I might be a little rusty in that regard. Yep, 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 okay, you gotta, you gotta follow him, you gotta follow him, get some hits in, don't let, yeah, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta run a little better than this, you gotta run a little better than that, it's fine, 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 get a hit, oh, I froze him, <laughs> okay, that works, oh, hold up, should I do it? that way instead and by that way i mean just tank him because you can't stun lock this guy anymore it's impossible but i can technically freeze stun lock him oh i mean once again i do not ever recommend tanking this guy he does a hundred damage a shot everybody that is way way too flipping much but with the fact that I can literally freeze him in place. Okay, I gotta make sure I actually freeze him this time because I gotta heal. <laughs> but yeah, ooh. Okay, I wish it's gonna run around the guy, but I'm not gonna do that anymore. Besides folks, it shows off Klops's unique perk and that's what this is all about. Oh my goodness, that was great. And what did I get out of it? Honestly, not that great. Yeah, not great, folks, but this is great. Get my sanity all the way back up. I am now back up to snuff, even after tanking one of the hardest hitting bosses in the flipping game. And now it's Ancient Archive time. Let's do it. Step one, deconstruct us, a lovely moon callers. Step two, realize how long this series has been going because yeah, I still have Winter's Feast stuff everywhere, so I'm just gonna feast because I can. Step three, smash your way into the archives. Step four, literally smash the archives. Step five, clear the way in the archives. Step six, activate the archives. Step seven, forget to clear the entire path so you have a little, oh, you got a little bit of clearing to do, but hey, toss a little fun in the end, why don't we? Step eight, flush a lovely blue toilet. Step nine, do a lovely memory puzzle. And the final step 10, everybody, solve it, read a blueprint. Oh, yep, it's under structures, right? And get yourself an astral detector or two or three or five however many a wish beautiful everybody absolutely beautiful and you know what it's autumn folks and autumn means we get to have fun with moose goose next week and it's gonna be fun trust me on that one she's gonna be doing a lot and building off of what we did today but is also gonna have one of the coolest boss fights there might ever be so I'll see you then. Bye-bye.